So the new department officially started on midnight of July 1st, and there are some officers that remain from when it was the unified precinct, and there are some new faces too. But the biggest change is really in the oversight. Sergeant Jeff Smith worked in West Valley for six and a half years, Salt Lake City for two, and now he has a new assignment. Taylorsville Police. At midnight on July 1st, the city officially transitioned from Unified to Taylorsville's own police department. And I came in at six in the morning to a very mild and yeah. easy start. Smith is a patrol so. supervisor. He says a lot of the calls here will be about the same. Domestics, traffic accidents, trespassers. Mayor Christy Overson says the big difference will be in the oversight. We decided it needs to be local. Before switching to Unified, Taylorsville did have their own department until around 2012. Why now? Why try this again? We thought this is a good opportunity to evaluate where we are and bring our public safety to our community, tailor it to our community's needs. And what will be different about Taylorsville PD versus the Taylorsville branch of Unified? So what you'll see is we have local control over policy, over budget, um, anything public safety related, the control is here at City Hall rather than with a larger agency. As Mayor Overson had a seat on the UPD board, but having their own department gives the city full control. Previous reporting shows contracting UPD services for fiscal year 2021 cost around 10.5 million. Estimates for using their own department in 2022 are around 11.1 million. The mayor says she isn't sure what unified services would have cost this fiscal year, but we feel that the budget for our unify our um, Taylorsville Police Department is comparable to what we would have been assessed from UPD, but the point being that it's local control. The department is made up of around 70 officers. Some stayed on from the former Unified Department, and some, like Deputy Chief Todd Gray, came from other departments nearby. West Valley, uh, Salt Lake City, uh, Sandy, Murray, um, a couple from out of state. Many are seasoned officers like Sergeant Smith. When asked about any growing pain switching to a new department, he said, Geographically, I'm having to learn the city here and where stuff is and where we're going. But other than that, it, it, it feels just like police work. Now, they started work this week ahead of what could be a busy weekend with the 4th of July. Coming up at 6, hear what their patrols will look like. That's when we speak with the deputy chief. In Taylorsville, Haley Crumpleholm, 2 News.